Welcome back to NTV's Good Life. Well, we all know that Monday is our NTV blood drive, and we thought we, you know, need to help get those numbers up. And so we're That's very right. happy to have joining us today here on NTV's Good Life is Communications Director, American Red Cross, Josh Murray. Thank you for being with us this morning. Good morning. It's great to be here. Well, it is amazing to have you. Yeah, and Josh, we all know that um, there can never be enough blood donations, right? Right, yeah, blood is not something we can stockpile. So even if we have a good couple of weeks, it doesn't mean that's gonna get us through the month of May or through the month, uh, the months of the summer coming up. So we have to kind of constantly be, be collected at a high level, which means we need donors to come out regularly. And this Monday is a great opportunity for that to happen. Uh, but we have blood drives across the area every day and we just need donors to, to continue to come out. Those who come out regularly, we appreciate those. Uh, those who, who haven't, this is an opportunity maybe to start, maybe try something and, and hopefully it's a, uh, the start of a long time thing that you do, uh, you know, throughout your life. Well, talk a little bit about that because there's some out there that have kind of have that fear of giving blood or I'm, I, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a hard <laughs> stick. What would you tell those people? Yeah, you know, a lot of times we hear the people who haven't given, it's because they just didn't try and they, they were nervous about it. But once they did come, they realized it is an easy process. It's a quick process. Uh, the do donation itself takes less than 10 minutes uh, by the time from the door the time you arrive, the time you leave, it's 45 minutes the process to do. But uh, we try to try to make it a really thoughtful process for you. There's a little bitty, you know, pin trick that you're going to get that you're going to feel in the stick, but it's very quick, it's very painless, going to go away, you know, right at the end. So we do it for give it a shot, give it a try. It is a life saving activity you can do. Yeah. And, you know, for a little bitty, uh, maybe a small second of uncomfortableness, it's a uh, that there's a good outcome from it. Okay, well, I, I take your word on that because I'm a wimp, and, and which is no excuse. I mean, the blood is needed more, mm -hmm. and I know Ronnie has done it, you know, a hundred times at least over. So um, is there any specific blood type that you're good always question. in more need of? You know, all blood types are needed, so we don't want to discourage someone if I say that a certain blood type is needed, but good others point. don't. But type O is the most common use. Blood, so we do encourage the people if you are owed definitely consider because that is something that we that we always are in need of uh, but that doesn't mean the others were not in need of so if you're an a or b uh, do please consider that as well can you can you tell us our blood type when we go to give blood if we don't know what it is uh, we can't do it at that moment okay. uh, but you don't need to know uh, to give uh, but we will go through testing and then we'll, we'll determine we'll later okay. but you don't know at that point because I always want I, I, I was I did know once upon a time, mm -hmm. but I forgot. So it's good to know, though. So for those that may have given blood before, um, I that may not know that there's an app. It's a it's a rapid pass. Can oh. you kind of explain? Because that kind of if you think, man, I just really don't have that much time. Can you kind mm -hmm. of explain the rapid pass and what that means? Absolutely. Part of the process when you come to get blood is we're gonna have to ask you some questions. It talks about some of your health history, what medicines maybe you're on or you have been on, if you've had treatments, then things like that. And we just have to ask you those questions before we are able to take take your blood. You can get a lot of those questions answered before you even come through the app. Like you mentioned the rapid pass. And if you make an appointment, you get an email with the direct link to those questions as well. Um, and that will just speed up the process. You can do that from your phone, from your tablet, from home before you leave. And then once you get that, that'll save you time. We'll still have to ask you a couple questions. We're going to take your blood pressure, things like that. But it will be a quicker process for you and hopefully get you in and out the door a little bit, a little bit quicker. Yeah, well, it, there is there is a great need. There's always a great yeah. need. So, Josh, um, thank you for being with us this morning. We appreciate your time. Well, thank you all for your support for this drive. We appreciate it. You bet. You're and welcome. you can go to our website, Nebraska.tv, to find out where you can, uh, you know, give the gift of life. Donate blood coming up on Monday for NTV's blood drive. Already sounds good. And we have more. Stay with us. Good. And we have more. Stay with us.